Are bats flying mice? Do they want to drink our blood? Can bats catch fish? Stick around to learn more about the shy, misunderstood creatures known as bats. Number one. Are bats really flying mice? Sadly, no. Although they may look like rats with wings or flying rodents, bats are not related to rodents. Research suggests that bats are related to primates such as monkeys, apes, and even humans. Number two. Bats are the only mammals that can fly. Some other mammals may be able to glide or float on air, but bats are the only mammals that can actually fly. However, a bat's lack of feathers and inability to lay eggs mean it can't be classified as a bird. Their ability to achieve true flight makes them unique in the world of mammals. Number three. Do bats really want to drink our blood? It's complicated. Bats mostly feast on fruit or insects, but the blood-sucking minority of bats have given the species a bad reputation. There are 1,400 species of bats, and only three are vampire bats. Though vampire bats have been known to bite humans, they feed mostly on livestock blood. Number four. Some bats can catch fish. Some bats use echolocation to identify disturbances made by fish on the surface of the water. However, different bats have different diets. For example, insectivorous bats live solely on a diet of insects. Frugivorous, or fruit bats, live solely on fruit, seeds, and nectar. Hematophagous bats live solely on a diet of blood. Number five. Bats are more important to the environment than you may think. Just like butterflies and bees, they are pollinators that spread pollen as they move from plant to plant. Bats are particularly effective pollinators for fruits such as mangoes, bananas, and avocados. Not only that, but insectivorous bats are excellent pest controllers. They feed on insects that would otherwise be a nuisance. Hope this video answered all your bat questions. To learn more about bats, head to twinkle.com.